Tyler, not only do industrial dry cleaners release toxic chemicals, they also, some of them use a lot of water for steam. Now one Atlanta-based startup is not only making dry cleaning cleaner, but also more convenient. It's kind of like a vending machine for dry cleaning. At least that's how the execs at Presso describe it, but it's a little different. We actually invented an entirely new clothing care process from scratch with compostable organic cleaning liquids that we synthesized in our own office with our own engineers, as well as new ways to stretch and press clothes. The Presso machine consumes seven times less water and three times less electricity than traditional laundry and dry cleaning services, according to the company. It also eliminates transportation to a cleaning facility, and all that reduces the carbon footprint of the clothing care by 93 percent. There are no hangers that are disposable. There's no disposable plastic bags. None of the process of even doing logistics inside a dry cleaning facility, none of that exists anymore. Presso now has machines in a few boutique hotels and apartment buildings, but it's pushing into the big hotel brands like IHG. It has machines now at two Holiday Inns and plans to expand to more IHG properties. Franchise owner Dipan Patel says the guest response has been very positive. Once we get the, the service to a point where our guests are educated and people are comfortable using the services, I don't see a reason why it won't be in every hotel in the country. Presso is backed by Uncourt Capital, Cherubic Ventures, 1517 Fund, Ame Cloud Ventures, SOSV's Hacks, and Pathbreaker Ventures. Total funding so far, just under $10 million. Presso doesn't have a lot of competition in the industrial space, but it hopes to bring these machines to consumers at home. There is already some competition in that market, but Presso's CEO likens it to the microwave, the way that moved quickly from restaurants and industrial use to become one of the most popular home appliances. And by the way, it's also a lot cheaper than sending your clothes out. Back to you guys. I mean, I'd get one now if it's going to be, what, 150 bucks? <laughs> Yeah, I mean, I don't know what that price would be yet, but it's supposed to be a lot cheaper going forward. Yeah, no, absolutely. Uh, fascinating, Diana. Thank you very much.